Assalamu alaikum dear viewers today i am going to tell you the story of an old woman and the prophet peace be upon him from which you can learn the biggest lesson of your life and as well as you can learn english words and vocabularies please watch the video till the end and do subscribe our youtube channel for more interesting videos a long time ago there lived an old woman who was carrying a heavy load along the road in the desert. It was a bit difficult for her, but she was managing as best as she could. The Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him was going somewhere in the desert. When he saw this old woman, the Prophet helped her and took the luggage from the woman and carried it for her. He asked the woman, where she was going and why she said that i am living in this town and i have heard that a magician named muhammad is in town that man upset me so much more than you could know i hear of his name and reputation everywhere i go though his family and his clan once knew him as honest man he is dividing everyone with his claim that God is one. He has misguided all the weak, the poor, and the slaves. They think they have all upon wealth and freedom by following his way. She sarcastically snorted. She was a very talkative woman, and the prophet did not want to interrupt her, so he let her speak the entire time. They were together without interruption. While walking with the prophet, the old woman noticed that the young man peace shone when he smiled, and he had a humble peace, and she also noticed that his sweat was perfumed. She was very impressed. They reached their destination, and the man helped the woman put away her belongings. The old woman, with a wide smile of gratitude at the strongest kindness, turned to him and said, Thank you, gentlemen, for this kindness. And you have really been so kind. The generosity and smile is very rare to find nowadays. Let me give you some advice, since you have been so very nice to me. Stay away from Muhammad, don't heed his words or emulate his way. If you do, you will never have to true peace, and all you will find is trouble. As the young man turned to walk away, she stopped him. Now before we fought and go, if it's all right, just the same, may I ask my dear young man one question? Who are you? And what's your name? He told her and she stopped dead in her tricks. Forgive me, but what was that? Your words weren't very clear. My ears are getting old, and sometimes I have a hard time hearing. You know, it's truly rather funny, but I sure I must be wrong. Yet I thought, I heard you say that your name is Muhammad. Yeah, I am Muhammad, said the holy prophet. I am the person because of whom you left the town. The old lady was amazed to listen that and said that such a kind helping and true person can never be wrong. She replied, I bear witness there is nothing worthy of worship except God and Muhammad is the messenger of God. And that day she too became the follower of Islam. The prophet offered to help this woman, and all she does throughout their encounter is to mock and malign the prophet. Yet he says nothing, he continues to help the woman. He does not leash back at her, he does not pray for God's destruction upon her. Now he helps the woman anyway, and when she finds out who he is all, she could do was follow him into Islam. We all should learn and follow the aspect of the Prophet Sunnah, and then we can make this world a better place.
Thank you.